Morning everyone. It is uh, Monday, so happy Monday. Hope you all had a lovely weekend. Um, I'm running a little bit late this morning, so this is it's half nine now, and I'm just walking down to the post office. Uh, get my little bit of activity in, start the day. I didn't end up getting up properly until about eight o'clock, which is late for me. Um, I was up in the middle of the night for about three and a half hours. Uh, I've got sleep disorder, so sometimes I have uh, bad nights, and uh, last night I was crap, so... Yes, I'm, I feel like I'm uh, running behind, but I'm actually doing okay. I was just thinking to myself, you, you, you're rushing around trying to get stuff done. Um, and you don't need to, just calm, calm down. It's now when you get something in your head that you're going to do this, this and this, and then something comes along and scuppers your plans a little bit. Sets me off, I like to know what's happening. So anyway, I'll see you in a bit. So I'm back home, it is uh, 20 to 12 and I fancy some brunch. So I'm going to spin you around and show you what I've decided to have today. I've got Heinz uh, tomato soup, that is a full tin in there, a normal size tin. I've got five cracker breads with, uh, these are the cracker breads that I use, the Rivita. And on top of that I've got some um, garlic and herb soft cheese and I've also got a full packet of this ham which is from Aldi it's got a little bit of a kick to it and it's nice so yeah that's what I'm having today and that's all like all of it listed in Nutri check the total calories for the whole meal will be 372 calories and if I pull back a little bit you can see what each individual item is okay Okay, it is oh, 10 to 4 in the afternoon and I haven't exercised yet and I'm kicking myself now because I don't want to be doing it. Um, but I want my tea soon so I've got to get it done now because I definitely won't do it after I've had my tea. So we're going to do that right now. See you in a minute. Here's tonight's tea. Uh, Barry's at work, so I'm just cooking for myself today. So I've got a large mixed salad. On there I've got honey and mustard dressed at dressing. I've got a portion of the uh, salt and pepper ridge uh, chips, two of the Boswell um, beef steaks, and some mustard. And then on the app, you can see it's all down there, what I've had. And that meal comes to 692 calories. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy that. Snack one is uh, Halo Top ice cream, what I've got left. That is 106 grams of ice cream and 16 grams of um, the Sweet Freedom. Uh, caramel syrup flavour, which is lovely. It tastes a little bit like um, golden syrup. And that's Halo Top I've had. I've still got calories left, so I'll have something else in a bit. Second snack of the evening is uh, pretzels. These ones, Penn State, sour cream and chive. There's 50 grams in there. And that comes to 206 calories. So I've still got 74 left for the day, but I'm within where I like to be between the 1400 and 1500. So that is me done for the evening. Okay. I'm trying to round this video up and I'm really struggling with this, this bit. Talking to the camera when I've got something or a couple of points to make. I don't know how to do it because I just go off track, start waffling and stumble over my words. So I must have filmed this about six times already. 
and then messed up and deleted it. So I'm just going to go for it and you're going to have to bear with, bear with me. Bear with me. Um, because I'm going to get through it. I'm going to get through it. Um, I've just had a shower. I'm chilling out now. I've got my pyjamas on. I've got conditioner treatment on my hair. Um, I'm going to watch something. Some, I don't know what I'm going to put on telly, but I'm just going to chill out and watch telly. It's just me and Winnie here. So, yeah, I can watch whatever I want. Um, <clears throat> Roundup of my vlogging week, because it's I started this last Monday. I've been enjoying it. It's been, it's been nice. It's been nice uh, sharing what I'm getting up to. And... Um, I love I love reading your comments. I love reading your comments and people who, who are also trying to lose weight or are just there to, to encourage me with what I'm open to do. Some of you know will know that I've been trying to lose weight for quite a while. Um mostly due to health issues. Um I've got two uh, health conditions that will Im hopefully improve with weight loss. Uh one is the sleep apnea which I mentioned this morning. Um and the other is high blood pressure. So yeah, it's not just to look good, it is to try and improve my health. Um, so that brings me on to the activity. I'm not naturally active. I'm not a naturally active person. I would happily sit cosy on my sofa all day, cuddling Winnie and watching telly or YouTube or whatever. Um, so yeah, it was something I decided to do in January. I mean, I do like swimming. Um, that was something that I started doing uh, I think it was last year, but then obviously the um, swimming baths and the gyms closed, so that that all stopped. Um, but even at my peak, I was only doing, I was only going swimming probably three times a week. Um, so yeah, becoming more active on a daily basis is something that I wanted to focus on, um, and I've been achieving. I've been achieving in January. I've um, it's not always been easy. I definitely need to work out in the mornings as opposed to leaving it till later in the day um get it get up get it done and it's done done and dusted then into that um i but i am more enjoying it more i am enjoying it more and it is definitely getting easier um diet wise i am absolutely loving calorie counting i have been a long time slimming worlder i have joined slimming world Oh, I don't even know how many times in the past. And like most, I mean, Slimming World does work. You will lose weight if you follow the eating plan. I'm not saying that you won't. But the problem I've had and people that I know in real life and on that I've spoke to online have with Slimming World is they will lose the weight and then come off the Slimming World plan as in the food optimising plan. Um, and cr things creep back in. Now, with calorie counting, I never feel like I've gone off plan. I don't feel like I'm on plan or off plan. I'm just eating what I like and fitting it into my calorie allowance. Um, so, yeah, I can see that this is going to work. This is going to work. And it's eye-opening eye-opening to things like portion sizes um i like big portions um i've told you that earlier on in the week i had the, i had the struggle when i made the meatballs because it was the meatballs and the pasta that was posing a problem so yeah i have i do i have had to cut down a little bit on things like that so but it's eye-opening how much i was eating before and of course, with with the Slimming World's free foods, um, I could have as much pasta and as many meatballs as I wanted. And because I'm a big eater, I would have a mountain of pasta and meatballs. So, yeah, it's it's drawing me in uh, on my portion sizes a little bit. I know my I know a lot of you will think my dinners are massive to say that I'm trying to lose weight. But like I said before, I need to know, I need to feel satisfied when I've eaten. When I've eaten my meal, if I feel satisfied, I don't think about food. If I have 
a small portion and I don't feel satisfied, I'm thinking I need something else, I need something else, I need something else. And that's where the snacks will, the snacks come in. So yeah, I've, I've, found, I've suited calorie counting to me and uh, my lifestyle and the way that I like to eat. And like I say, it's working well. I'm, I'm really, really pleased with it. Um, so yeah, I've gone off on a waffle. I've gone off on a waffle. <laughs> Bring it back in, Kelly. <laughs> anyway, yeah, today is my weighing day. I weighed in this morning. Um, I so close to my three stone award uh, last week and I didn't quite get there this week. I've lost two pounds this week. I needed to lose three pounds um, to get my three stone award. Um, but regardless, I'm pleased with two. I'm really pleased with two. Um, I mean, I started January at 15 stone. Uh, that's after my Christmas gain. And I am now 14.3 pounds so yeah getting close to that stone award uh three stone award and also getting close to the next stone down bracket so exciting times are ahead <laughs> exciting times are ahead yeah i'm feeling really optimistic um i mean that's i i, I don't know I, I just can't i can't put into words how I feel I feel just feel so positive about my cha the changes that I've made um I'm making I don't feel like I'm suffering in order to lose weight I don't feel like I'm exercising and suffering in order to lose weight I'm quite enjoying it um so yeah I'm really pleased I'm really pleased with how it's going and I'm pleased with how my mindset is with regards to trying to lose weight and get healthier. Um, so yeah, that is my roundup of the week and my weigh-in. So stay tuned. And uh, yeah, my weigh-in day is on a Monday. So if you don't want to watch what I do all week, but you just want to see how I've done, then you can always tune in on a Monday and I'll uh, let you know on the Monday vlog. Right, I'm going. Um, I've still got 400 calories left, but... I'm probably going to show you, before you see this, you'll have seen what I've had for my snack. So yeah, this isn't going to make sense, but I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I'll see you tomorrow. Ta so I'm in the office and I've just been updating my chart. So this one is for my exercise. So that's coming on nicely for January. Um, I've done a minimum of 30 minutes of activity so far in January. And then there is the weight loss for this week. So at the beginning of the year, I was 15 stone. We are now 14 stone, 3.6.